Dear Dr. Lawton, I'm writing to express my profound gratitude for saving the life of my wife. Through your expertise and dedication, you indeed saved her life. Those are the words that give a tingle down my spine. I'm Michael Lawton, neurosurgeon, and I'm also the leader of the Barrow Neurological Institute. I wear many hats, taking care of patients, trying to put together a big vision for where we are and where we'd like to go. What I do is about saving lives. There are patients that we treat where we just reach the end of the line. You get to this point where you have to tell them there's nothing more I can do for you. This is what drives us. We want to try and come up with things that allow us to push further and give something to patients who've hit the wall. Dr. Lawton, thank you for being here with us. Thanks for having me. Help us understand your vision. As a brain surgeon, we spend all of our time protecting the brain and trying to avoid violating the brain. After decades in the business, it just dawned on me that's really the wrong way to, to go about this. We should be actually diving into the brain, not literally, but figuratively, and figuring out how this works. We can't do this ourselves. We know our anatomy, we know our technique, but we don't know supercomputing, and we don't know AI and edge computing. We've, we've reached the dawn of this era where we can do this. There's a quote, and I forget who said this, but we are drowning in a sea of data, but we're thirsty for knowledge. And we need the tools to take the data and convert that into knowledge. And in my mind, that's because the human brain is not capable of doing that. When I teach a resident, they might be handling the instruments awkwardly, they might be moving in the wrong direction, and I can coach them. But data can do that too. If we have the capability to take surgical video and have a computer analyze their moves, their hand motions, the way that things move in the field, that can also be a mentor. All the data is there, the surgical video, the radiomics, the hand tracking, it's all there. We have all of the technology to gather that data. It's just we've never had before the computing power to integrate those data sets and, and to extract the lessons. Imagine that as I'm operating, these insights can flash in my eyepiece and I can see or envision a technology that says, okay, you're veering off to the left too much, you need to go right. Or beware, there's this artery that's around this corner that you can't see. Why not have that in the operating space? So it almost sounds like that's one of the first steps of achieving the vision, is turning each operating room into that edge node, but from the perspective of data collection. Dell Technologies with our Dell AI factories, uh, with NVIDIA, our native edge solutions, I think we can make that vision reality and we would love to be on that journey with you.